Hey guys, how's it going? Um, just want to give you guys a bit of an update about what's going on this week. I know I said that I was going to get back into streaming this week. Unfortunately, I didn't know or I may have forgotten that a co-worker of mine is having a uh, baby. Uh, the co-worker is the day shift yard dog driver. Uh, so I'm going in early at around, uh, well, I, 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 need, uh, I need to be there in five minutes. So I'm literally about to go right now uh, to get there and help out. And I usually start streaming right now, 10 o'clock in the morning. So yeah, it's not going to happen. I'm going to literally be over there every morning at around 10 a.m., um, to basically help them out with whatever they need, um, basically be of assistance. Uh, I mean, hey, it, it's it's going to be great overtime uh, at the end of the day, and I'm sure he would do uh, the exact same for me. When, well, whenever I uh, go to my convention next month, I'm, I'm sure he wouldn't mind, you know, covering me on Thursday or Friday, or if not like a very large part of Thursday, or if not Thursday, then definitely Friday, since Fridays are usually shorter than the other four days of the week, of the work week. So I've yet to talk to my boss about going to MobileCon. I've yet to buy my tickets, but I'm definitely going to probably... Uh, mention it and say, hey, um, I'm going to a convention next month. Is it possible that I can get Thursday and slash or Friday off um, to go to this convention? It's going to be great fun. I'm, I'm going to I'm going to have a lot of fun. And, you know, if, if I can't get both days off, I would rather get Friday off. That way I can go Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, and not miss out on a lot of stuff uh, that week, or yeah, that weekend, that entire weekend, so I'm definitely going uh, for sure, I'm, I'm just trying to figure out what days I can get off, uh, if I can get any off at the moment, um, but yeah, it, it's, it's going to be, it's going to be great, I really can't wait, I'm sure um, the, the, uh, Temp company wouldn't mind me taking the day off. Um, you know, it, it's just a Friday. It's the Friday before Memorial Day. What's the literal worst that could happen? Honestly, <laughs> day before a holiday weekend. Um, yeah, I don't. I don't really know what's uh, what's really in store for next month. I know Mother's Day's coming up, so I'm going to be visiting. Of course, my mom for that. My parents' house, we're having another cookout then. And then, of course, we'll do a Memorial Day cookout that Monday because my dad are, my dad already knew, hey, there's a convention that weekend. I might want to go to it. So why not do a cookout on Mondays? That way I can go to my convention and not have to worry about having to be at my parents' house at such and such time. That way I can enjoy the most out of this convention. Um, I'm probably not going to buy a hotel room since I literally live like 20 minutes from Atlanta. So, you know, getting back and forth, uh, in between home and Atlanta is definitely not a problem, especially when I plan on staying very, very late Friday and Saturday. So, um, you know, it's... Whatever at the end of the day, hearing a lot of beeps. Um, so yeah, it, it, it's it's gonna be crazy. Um, I should probably really get going though. Uh, I'm probably gonna be late, but you know what? He already knows I'm coming in early. I'm gonna try to get in early at around this time. Uh, the only reason why I'm making this video now is to really let you guys know what's going on. So you know, all as well as ends well. So I'm going to go ahead, uh, pack up my switch, and get going. Oh, I should probably bring my boots as well. So, anywho, uh, I hope you guys understand. 
that this is a thing that's going on this week. So very little streaming will happen this week. The most that I will uh, be able to do is Friday. Uh, so Friday, I'll set my wheel up somewhere over here on my couch. Um, I'll set my wheel up and then Friday, we'll get back into iRacing and um, do some stuff with iRacing. So looking forward for that. Oh, Odyssey Quest is coming out next month. So as soon as I get my tax return, I'm definitely going to invest in Odyssey Quest. I am not sure if I'm going to be able to stream off of that. If I am, great. But as of the moment, it doesn't require a PC. There's no wires. So I'm very, very curious as to how this thing is going to work. So, yeah, I, I don't know. I really, I really don't know. I don't know if it's going to, if, if there's, if it's going to be able to connect to my Steam account. Because, you know, VR Chat is on the Oculus Store. So I can definitely sign in off of VR Chat on the Oculus Store version of VR Chat. I'm pretty sure that's an option. Um... But other than that, I'm definitely going to invest into the Odyssey Quest since it's only around $200, 200 maybe $300, I think. Um, so yeah, that's, that's definitely something I'm going to invest in. Uh, if not, like, maybe put like $100 down and then pay like another 100 the next week and then however much I have left the week after that. Uh, see if I can, like, do some down payments so I can, like, get it and then keep paying for it, like, the next fucking week. And not, it won't, literally won't even interfere with my rent, since the only thing that I'm really worried about is rent. So, I'm definitely going to keep an eye out for the Odyssey uh, quest. I'm definitely going to put some money into it as soon as I get my tax return. Um, and uh, I'm going to try to just you know, save my money, um, you know, so I can keep up to date with my car payment, keep up to date with my, um, rent and all that good stuff. I still need to contact. I, well, you know what? Waste management has my number blocked. So I don't, I don't, I don't know why they blocked my number. I, I can't even call, I, I can't even call the place that I used to work at to get my W2. And I'm almost afraid to even show up because they might call the cops on me for trespassing. But really, I'm just trying to get my W-2. So maybe if I explain that to the police, they'll be like, where's his W-2? But at the moment, I can't get my W-2. So I don't know who to even contact. So if somebody could find like a corporate number for me to contact, that'd be great. I would absolutely love that. I would love... A corporate number to call so I can try to get my W-2 before I go do my taxes sometime this week. I'm probably going to try to do it this weekend since I have nothing else to do. Uh, I got no other events going on. Um, I know VWE, we have a King of the Arena on Friday, but that's really all that's going on. So I have literally nothing to do. I'll have enough money to cover for get my tax return done, uh, taxes filed and everything. I'm probably just going to go up to uh, H&R Block, uh, the closest one to me, and uh, just get it done. But um, for the moment, I, I'm i currently, number one, late on doing my taxes. And number two, I don't even have all of my tax returns because Waste Management hasn't given me my W-2, which... Number one, they should have in January. And I gave them up to literally the 1st of March before I started calling them. And they literally have been ignoring me. They've been ignoring my calls. They blocked my number. And there's no corporate number to call. 
I don't know if there's even a corporate number to call. I don't even know who to call anymore. So I'm I'm very frustrated, very pissed that this has happened. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and go to work now before I'm even more late or before I get a phone call saying, hey, where are you? Uh, so yeah, I'm going right now. When you guys get this video, I will definitely, definitely, definitely be working and not um, here on my laptop. So, you know, keep that in mind. Anywho, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoy uh, my content, please leave me a like and a subscribe and hit that notification bell when, uh, so you get my videos whenever they come out. And head on over to my Twitch down in the description below. Follow me on there. Hit the notification bell on there so you can get notified whenever I go live on Twitch. And maybe a podcast recording or live stream this weekend on the channel. Not entirely sure. Either on Twitch or YouTube. I can't figure out which would be better. Most likely YouTube right here on YouTube. Because at least it'd be stored for, um, for whatever. But uh, we'll, we'll definitely... Um, We'll definitely do it right here on YouTube. So anyways, thank you guys for watching. Um, hope you guys have a wonderful week. Uh, I'm going to try to get these uh, how to uh, do these dry videos. Do the dry videos. Um, I think you guys are going to like them. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. And as always, I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day. Bye-bye.